Before starting, LAMP stack must be installed on your server. If not installed, you can install it with the following command. After installing L packages, edit the PHP configuration file and change some default settings. Change the following lines. Save and close the file, then restart the page service to apply the changes. Next, you need to connect to Marie Database shell with the following command. Once you are connected to Marie Database, create a database and user. Next, grant all privileges to the next cloud database with the following comment. Next, flush the privileges and exit from the Marie database. At the time of writing this article, the latest version of Nextcloud is 24.01. You can download it with the following comment. Once the download is completed, unzip the downloaded file with the following comment. Next, move the extracted directory to the page web root. Change the ownership and permission of the next cloud directory using following command. Next, you will need to create an app page virtual host configuration file for next cloud. Add the following lines. Save and close the file, then activate the Apache virtual host and other required Apache modules. Restart the Apache service to apply the changes. You can also check the status of the Apache with the following comment. Now open your web browser and access the next cloud web using the URL. You should see the following screen. Define your admin username, password, database and click on the install button. Once the Nextcloud is installed, you should see the following screen. Click on the Install recommended apps to install our required application. Congratulations! You have installed Nextcloud on your Ubuntu server. If you have any questions, leave them in comment. And remember, if you're looking for a good hosting solution, check our website for prices.